there's something that uh, in the movie where it's not Shakespeare, okay? But I got to tell you, it's really poetry. It's about the word, forget about it. Forget about it. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Can we hear the clip, please? Hey, can I ask you something? Well, what's forget about it? What is it? Forget about it. It's like uh, if you agree with someone, you know, like Raquel Welch is one great piece of ass. Forget about it. But then if you disagree, like a Lincoln is better than a Cadillac, forget about it. You know, but then. It- OK, can we stop there, please? <laughs> Leo, just uh, uh, I'm getting a brain freeze now, but. The actor that said that line, he's a famous, he became very famous. Oh, wait a minute, that, is that the guy in Billions, Giamatti? Giamatti. Is that Paul Giamatti? That's Paul, yep. That, he was a struggling actor at the time, and Lou, Lou, Lou put him in it. Yeah, yeah well, that's Paul. Now, Paul Giamatti, for anybody that knows, he was a star of Billions, and he's done so many great things. Oh, my God, yeah. Yep. And... Um, he plays an FBI agent that he hears... Sitting all, on a wiretap. Yeah, he hears all the wiretaps, and he's going to ask you a legitimate question. Now, here's the thing. Um, times, you know, times... that This is back in the 80s. So I, I said, uh, okay. He says, uh, Raquel Welsh, you know, is really hot. Forget about it, right? Who would we say now? Who is the poster girl now? Because <laughs> I, I thought of Kylie Jenner, right? Maybe. <laughs> and then they say, uh, what's better, a Lincoln or a Cadillac? Yeah. All right, well, now is it a Mercedes or a BMW or, or a Tesla? A Tesla. <laughs> <laughs> of course, a Tesla. Ah, uh, the mob chase. Okay, could we continue, please? But you know, but you know, everybody yeah. asked me, did we did, did uh, we make that up? Forget about it. But these guys used to say it all the time. Yeah. And I guess when I was talking to Paul, you know, I, I don't remember, but you know, I would say, and I said, that's a phrase that they use, you know. But I get asked that question all the time. Did you guys make that up? I said no. I mean, the guys that I hung around with. That that was something they said all the time. Forget about it. And the, and again, the inflection. That, yeah. that that tells you, you know, what it means. You know wh- how how you want to uh, take take the take the phrase or, or or the conversation. Sure. Well, it's in film uh, history. It's legendary. That dialogue from that scene. I mean, everybody brings it up. And, um, oh, let's continue. How, how about the sign they have in Brooklyn? Forget about it. You're leaving Brooklyn. Yes, <laughs> I know. Right? This is, it's, it's, it's brilliant. Let's continue and hear more about this. The forget about it. It's also like if something is the greatest thing in the world, like Mingo those peppers, forget about it, you know? <laughs> but it's also like saying go to hell, too. Like, you know, like, uh, Hey, Bully, you got a one-inch pecker, and Bully says, forget about it. Forget about it. Bully, right. forget about it. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, hold on. Ha, ha, ha. Oh, this is beautiful. Now, I can truthfully say this, Joe. Mean ghettos peppers, right? Mean ghettos peppers. You think today they'd say, mean that tofu. No. <laughs> <laughs> no, uh-uh, no, uh-uh. no, 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 tofu, to- to- tofu or yogurt don't, doesn't cut it with ming, yeah, <laughs> being an Italian, Leo, you know that, I know that, and Joe, you love to cook Italian, and you did it on the movie set, you did it on Falco, the series up again, it's Italians, it's religious, the cooking experience, and the eating experience, exactly, no, yeah. no, that's, that's beautiful. And then, of course, uh, Mr. Antanasio, I, I, I let you. I don't know whether you gave him this line. Paulie, Paulie's got a one-inch pecker, right? Paulie says, forget about it. Uh, I'm, he got a laugh in the movie theaters. I know that. 
Yeah, that was, that, that was Paul. That was yeah. all Paul. <laughs> that was Paul. Okay, could we continue, please? <laughs> Sometimes it just means uh, forget about it. All right. Thank you very much. I got it. Let me tell you something. I don't get this bow for Lefty. What? Forget about it? Fucking forget about it. Say, you know that sting operation? What, what do you call it? Where the, uh, where the agents dress up like Arabs and try to bribe congressmen? Yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. They got a boat down here. Huh? Abscam. That's right. A- okay, we can cut there. Um, very interesting, the tag on that scene, Joe, which yeah. sets up a lot of the Florida experience with the Trificantes and the boat. The boat was an FBI boat that was used in, and it was a front page stuff, the Abscam scandal where FBI agents dressed up like Arabs, correct? Correct. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. I mean, uh, that boat comes back to be something. Come back to haunt me. Almost got me killed. Almost got you killed. With Wow. Okay. Um, that is the forget about it. That, <laughs> good stuff, Joe. Okay. Um, to our loyal listeners out there, uh, we are going to continue in the next episode from movie clips. And Joe, who was right there, Joe, who was Johnny on the spot? No, that's... Eh. But you were right there, Joe. And I loved your takes on what really went down. And uh, the next one, we're going to talk with Lefty. And we're going to talk with Joe. And we're going to talk with Maggie, Joe's wife. And and it's, it's some serious stuff. And um, it's uh, very, very uh, passionate and poignant. So come back. We're going to give you more of Deep Cover. Forget about it. From Jam Street Media.